Hey, what is up everybody? This is the great Puckettini coming at you on behalf of PucketFanshop.com. And over at PucketFanshop.com is, is my website where I put dog designs on all kinds of products from stickers to socks to shirts, anything you can think of, we put dog designs on. And uh, if you're over there at, at PucketFanshop.com and you're looking for something we don't have, send me a message uh, and I'll try to get back to you. Uh, as quick as I can, and we'll try to add it. You know, we'd love to do business with you. Uh, we also do custom orders. Uh, the Australian Shepherd you see on my website there at the top uh, is is actually based on on my dog, and that, that was a drawing ba uh, made off my dog. And several of the dogs you see there on my website uh, were custom orders from some of my customers, of course. Uh, now, but what I'm doing today here on this video is I'm breaking down the Dallas Cowboys' six round draft pick, Devin Harper. And Harper is a six foot, 234 pound linebacker from Oklahoma State. And the first thing I look at is I look at their physical size to see if they have the size and speed to play at that position that they're at. And um, so prototype size for an NFL linebacker is about six foot one, 239 pounds, and they run about a four six nine forty. Um, now Harper is six foot, he weighs 234 pounds, and he runs a four five forty. So he has the size and speed to be an NFL linebacker. He's got he definitely has the natural ability and, and the size and speed. Then I look at his stats and the stats there in 2021 at Oklahoma State, he made 95 tackles, which is good. That's good production. 11 of those tackles were for a loss. He had six sacks. He had one pass defense. That means he was in coverage, knocked the ball down, or he had tight coverage and the pass was incomplete. He had two fumble recoveries, he forced one fumble, and he was also one of the team captains, which is very big as well. Um, but those are his stats. So he's very productive, uh, seems to be a, a leader, so a guy you'd like to have around, you know. Now next I look at his film, and uh, I looked at everything I could, and to be honest, there wasn't a whole lot of stuff just of him. I had a hard time finding a lot of clips of him, but I, I just got on YouTube and looked at everything I could. What I saw was he played a lot of outside linebacker, like an edge rusher in college. Um, he's not doing that for Dallas. He, I've watched him play in several uh, preseason games. He's kind of been that inside linebacker. But what I see is he's a high motor guy. He plays the whistle. He hustles to the ball. Uh, he's, he's always going to be hustling, and that's the kind of player you want, you know. I saw him miss a tackle in college, and he got back up and tackled the guy down the field. Uh, he didn't stop on the play. He didn't hang his head. He got up and chased him back down tackled him again. Hey, he, uh, I saw him make tackles in space one-on-one. -on -one. He also goes for the strip, too, when he can. He, he attacks the football, which is good. The NFL is a game of turnovers. Usually the team that wins that turnover battle wins the game a lot of the time. So that's real big. He understands to, to strip the ball to try to get it on the ground. He can cover also. You know, I saw him uh, read QB's eye one time. Uh, he was in like a zone cover, read QB, and he got to the spot before the receiver was there and uh, made an interception. Uh, so did a good job. So he can cover as well. Now, next thing I look at is how will he fit in? And uh, one thing is the Cowboys have a very talented group of linebackers. You know, I count right now they have nine linebackers that have prototype size and speed, and that's a bunch. You're not going to carry nine linebackers probably. So it's going to be hard for him to make the team, but I think since he was draft pick, he should be able to make it. He may be on the practice squad, but if nothing else, he should be able to add some depth, and he'll have to be a special teams player, which I think he will be. He's got good size and speed. Should be a special teams player, and he'll have to be to make the team. But it will be hard for him. Uh, I hope he does. He's a high motor guy, good athlete, but Dallas does have a lot of good linebackers. Now, in my opinion, uh, Devin Harper is another good pick. He has prototypical size and speed. He's an aggressive tackler with a high motor. He plays the whistle and he can make tackles in space. Should be a good special teams player, uh, you know, and, I, and he'll have to do that to make the team. He can play the run well, he covers well. He can blitz off the edge or up the middle too. He has good timing. And he can rush the passer from outside linebacker position. You know, he really can do a lot of things. So he's a, a tool that you really could use in a lot of different ways. Uh, he was very productive in college at a high level in the Big 12 there at Oklahoma State. And he was a team captain. So sounds like the kind of player, like I said earlier, that you'd like to have around on your team. 
Um, and that's, that's all I got really. So in closing, you know, I think Cowboys made another good pick. I think they had a really good draft, and we're seeing a lot of them play well here in the, pre- in the preseason. This is uh, – they just played um, – Last night they played. I can't remember they played uh, the Seattle Seahawks, and this is Saturday right after that game. Is when I'm making this video. But anyway, so if you like this video, please hit the like button and uh, subscribe to the Great Puckettini channel. I post videos on the Dallas Cowboys and the Arkansas Razorbacks. Also, go to my website over there, PucketFanshop.com. I'll have a link for it in the description here, and uh, see if we got anything over there you might like. If we don't, if you'd like to see a certain kind of dog breed, I don't have. Just get in touch with me. Reply to this video. Uh, send me an email. I'd love to do business with you. I do business. Uh, I'll, I'll try to strike a deal with you. Uh, so, anyway, until next time, we'll see you guys later. Have a great day. Go Cowboys.